as those who were there when a Franklin County deputy shot and killed a Columbus man. They all share very different stories. Good evening to you, everybody, and thanks for joining us at 11. I'm Carrie Charles. And I'm Colleen Marshall. Columbus police and the FBI have both launched separate investigations into the killing of 23-year-old Casey Goodson, whose family says he was shot multiple times by Deputy Jason Mead as he was returning from the dentist office and a stop at the subway store. The attorney representing the deputy telling us today at no time did Deputy Mead mistake a sandwich for a gun. Mr. Goodson pointed his gun at Deputy Mead. There has been confirmation that our client gave verbal commands for Mr. Goodson to drop the gun. A CPD spokesperson tells us they cannot confirm if those commands were in fact given. Police are only saying there are reports of a verbal exchange, but the nature of that possible exchange has not been made public. Investigators have also not said that Goodson pointed a gun at the deputy. Meanwhile, we also heard again today from Tamala Payne, Goodson's mother. She repeated that her son did nothing wrong or illegal last Friday. One of her attorneys had this to say. Casey's not a suspect in any way, shape, or form. Casey was someone who was killed on his kitchen floor simply because he was a black man and his skin was weaponized. Attorney Walton and his partners, they are telling us they do intend to seek an independent autopsy as we await the final autopsy from the coroner. New and only on four tonight, Congresswoman Joyce Beatty tells us she is personally monitoring the investigation into Casey Goodson's death, which she called tragic and a travesty. She says it is important for everyone to remember that while a U.S. Marshals Task Force was conducting an operation in Goodson's neighborhood, he was not the target. This young man was not the subject of anything other than coming home to be with his family. Coming home from the dentist, according to his family, with food in hand. And this young black man going into his home with sandwiches in one hand, a key in his hand to open the door, and if he had anything else in his hand, I still believe that's not a threat. How could that be a threat? Pictures shared by his mother show the key in the door and the sandwiches. I've talked with his mother uh, multiple times. I'm following everything. I'm flying home to make sure that I am in the district as we deal uh, with this issue. Beatty will be part of a weekend protest of the shooting death and what she calls a flawed investigation. Because federal investigators are involved, are you getting any insight into how long this investigation might take or where the investigation heads next? I believe, and I'm being very careful to say what I believe. I believe this took too long because I have heard from experts that part of the problem is, again, there was a misstep, that it took too long. So now you have divisions of law enforcement to say they want hands off because it's been too muddy. Beatty says the case is getting national attention. Other members of Congress are asking how they can help. She says by finding a way to stop cases like this. We have to make sure as we put Casey's face on this, that maybe it's the face that will bring us together. Maybe it's the face that will help us fight for justice. And certainly his mother wants that justice, wants it brought to justice for her son. And of course, Congresswoman Joyce Beatty elected as the new chairperson of the Congressional Black Caucus. And she told me today that they will be taking up issues like this of police-involved shootings involving African Americans and also just overall social justice and where we go from here as a nation. When that organization, the CBC, holds its annual conference, it'll be interesting to see how that issue is front and center. You can imagine. Yeah, they're, the they're dealing with COVID, of course, yeah. as the overarching issue in Washington, but they're going to have to tackle some of these things in the coming year as well. Yeah.